New at 6, the Central Avenue Water and Wastewater Pipe Repair Project. It's officially done right now. Now, crews have been working since July the 7th to replace the pipes. And Queen City News anchor Morgan Francis is there tonight with details on the timeline and frustrations from area business owners. This area has seen its fair share of projects from a water main break to now a wastewater leak. This stretch of Central Avenue seems to constantly be under construction and area businesses are hoping this will be the last of it. Yep, no, not sick of seeing you, but you know, sick of seeing all this construction and everything happening out here on the road. Throughout the years, Central Avenue at Hawthorne Lane has experienced closure after closure. Crews responsible for the repairs end up ripping up the asphalt to get to the core of the problem, shutting down the street in the process. I believe we initially heard it was going to be done last Friday, and they keep pushing it back further and further. July 7th, someone reported a missing manhole cover. An investigation uncovered a lot more. This is an old manhole that was made of brick and mortar. The bricks were starting to uh, crumble. The mortar was falling into the manhole. We also found that it was leaking, causing a spill and it became an emergency repair. But some wonder if construction cones will forever line this street. From what I heard from one of the contra or the foremen, uh, they were saying with the train that goes by all the time and then just the amount of people that are here that there's a lot of, you know, just shaking that goes on underground. So that doesn't help, you know, fix anything over here. The impact this time around seems to depend on the type of business. Just ready for it to be over with. <laughs> really main, main part is the parking for us. We've definitely gotten lots of calls that are like, oh my gosh, how do I get in? We haven't really seen much of a decline in like dinner time sales, but lunch has been kind of hurting. The last update we have from Charlotte Water is that this project will be completed tomorrow. Area businesses are estimating more toward the end of this week. Reporting in Plaza Midwood, I'm Morgan Francis, Queen City News.